If you are running electronic shifters, you can install our DI2 tube upgrade kit as an accessory option. The tubing is of a slightly smaller diameter and allows all your cables to match. You can route the DI2 tubing internally or under the frame using the clips or cable ties included to secure it in place. Be careful not to over tighten cable ties as they may prevent the fluid from passing through the tube. When routing the tubing internally, feed a piece of gear or brake cable through the frame and use this to draw through the tubing for the system. Ensure you have enough tubing at each end. At one end, you will need to allow for the reservoir to be engaged and disengaged from the bracket and at the other end for the rear mech to move through its entire range without being impeded. You will need approximately 10mm of tubing to insert into the reservoir and 7mm of tubing to insert into the dispenser. Once you have chosen how to route your tubing, insert the larger end of the DI2 tubing into the nozzle at the base of the reservoir. Do not insert the tube into the dispenser until you have primed the system.